Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm at Justice. In today's video, I'm going to be putting up a Pokemon Go Elite Trainer Box versus a Radiant Eevee Premium Collection Box. Both for £52.50 with some slight differences in contents. So, without further we ado, let's get it. Alright, guys, here's the Pokemon Go Elite Trainer Box. And here is the Radiant Eevee Premium Collection. I'm going to open the Elite Trainer Box first and then I'll do the Radiant Eevee next Yeah, I'll do it like that So, let's leave this on the side for now Alright Alright guys, so as we open this Elite Trainer Box um, I have opened up both products already on the channel So if you're new to this channel and you would like to see like a detailed look into the contents or the hits from those videos Links will be in the description down below. Here's your Pokemon Go mobile game code cards. Codes, codes, not code cards, codes. There you go. I'll do a quick overview anyway of what you get in the contents. Wow, what in the hell happened there? Make sure no cards are stuck. Okay, cool. Um, here's your code card. There's your muted sleeves. Another badly centered Mewtwo promo card. Freak of energies. Condition and V star markers. And then your damage counters and you die. Alright, so let's get these packs. Hopefully, I didn't get jibbed. Should be 10 packs. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Perfect. So in the early trainer box, you'll get 10 packs. A new way of giving out pull cards, guys. I'm going to leave them on the play map. And, all, and it's going to be double call cards as well in the video. Yeah, um, elite trainer box, 10 gold cards. I mean, 10, 10 booster packs. Radiant Eevee, you get 8. But well, in the Radiant EV, you get a play mat, which is probably what covers the cost of the two booster packs. I'll say even better than that, to be honest. So for the same price, Let's wow. Go! First pack magic on the Elite Trainer Box, guys. We got a Radiant Blastoise. Nice. And this one looks quite nicely centered. And the Gyarados Hollow. This one's not badly centered, so I might actually put it. Oh, I slanted. Ah, I might send it in for I might send it in for grading, I might not. Alright, so first pack magic with a Radiant Blastoise on the Elite Trainer Box, guys. Yeah, I'd say, to be honest, choosing between these two, which one to open. To me, I'd say Radiant Eevee, because of the play map, and the pin, and the Promo. I think if you sold those, you make just about under half back. So you'd be paying. So if you open more than one, you'd be making half back from how much you paid. Whereas with the Elite Trainer Box, the promo itself is probably going to make you a little bit back. But the other contents, not so much. Alright guys, I'll probably throw it on screen as well After opening so far every product Yep, I've opened up every product I'll throw up like an image of what I need left Reverse Larvitar, nice Yahoo! and a metal Mel Metal V, nice, that's what I need for the master set Perfect Yes The funny thing is, as I pull this I think this and the Conkilder Conkilder, 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 whatever Name is um, wrong sleeve. Those two are the easiest cards to pull so far, by this, but from what I've seen. But yeah, it's taken me probably about 40 plus packs now to open to even pull just the first one. I mean, that conquer though for sure. That 
gets pulled in almost every video that I've seen and I haven't even pulled my first one so I don't know what's going on there Import the dog, magic art, Meltan, reverse Sylveon, I believe I do need that one, yes! There we go, now I've completed all the hollows in the set, that was the last one that I needed My last video, which was the reading Eevee on its own, I pulled the Venusaur And now I've managed to pull the Articuno Alright, so now all I need is I think three cards left to complete the main set part of the or the main set before ultra rares, like full arts and stuff like that to complete it. Leaf energy, egg incubator, camera, egg candy, lavata, normal. That should put me up to I believe reverse water to an abyssy. Should put me up to 70. I was on 67, right? I have a 69. Nice. nice. Or 70. What I mean is it? Left. Take a left. And before I believe I do need that one left for solo. When it comes down to reverse hollows, though, that's probably going to be the hardest part to complete. Probably going to end up having to buy those singly. But in terms of um, Pokemon Go anyway, we have up until I believe... I think the last products are releasing, is it in September? If it's not September, it's August. So another month from now. Oh my day. Wow, yes! A full art Melmetal V, nice. This could be a Melmetal Elite Trainer Box. Melmetal V Elite Trainer Box, nice. Full art Melmetal V, perfect. Needed for the collection. There's no auto art, is there? I don't believe there is. I don't think there is. Um, I said this in my last video as well with the Radiant Eevee. If I know my luck when it comes to auto arts, which there are only two, won't be pulling them. I doubt I'll be pulling them. But if I do pull it, high five. I'll end the video right there. I'll give you obviously actually when I edit it, I'll probably show like I do the glam shot. But after the glam shot. Ending the video. Being so hollow. I will walk off the webcam and I will end the video. That's how sure I am it's not gonna happen. Even if I did it like, let's just say dependent, however much I open from now. If it's the first pack, I'll do it. So if the video is like 10 seconds long, which it won't be anyway, it'll be at least 2-3 minutes probably. But if the video was 10 seconds long, I'd walk off right there and then reverse EV and a new to EV, nice. So far, this elite trainer box isn't too bad. And I've opened two of them and they haven't been that bad. Alright guys, last pack, last pack. There's your whole card. Let me make sure that I open Avium. Um, here's two more. There you go. And last pack. Yeah, for an elite trainer box, not too bad guys. Three hits. A full art. A Mewtwo. I mean, uh, I might as well spoil it, it doesn't matter. In my last video, trainer box, I pulled a full art as well. So, pulling a full art in this one, nice. Pulled out, wait. Yeah, the Radiant. Yep, reverse Pupitar and Hollow Pikachu. So, I pulled a Radiant, a full art, and two Vs. Not too bad. Not too bad. Alright, guys, moving on to the Radiant Eevee. Here's your cold card for the Radiant Eevee. And here's the 
EV promo card itself. I do want to collect maybe like three of each of these or three of each radiant. One for the master set, one for a separate binder, and then one to grade. That would be nice. Eight packs, and let's get straight into it, guys. Let's get straight into it. There's your code card. Which one's gonna take the win? Ten packs or eight packs? Darkness Energy. Ivy Soul, Water Tool, Red Candy, Hit Barrel, Meltan, Magic Pot, Apron, Miss Pot Charmander. Should I keep that on the side? There's no point, is there? Nah. Egg Incubator and a Blissey. In terms of what I would like to pull multiple of, definitely the Radiants, like three of each at least, one for the Master Set, one for the Binder, one for like a separate Binder where I'm going to do V-Stars and Radiants and Trainer Galleries, and then I do want to grade a set of them as well, so Reverse Lapras, and we get a Mewtwo V-Star, nice, not a bad hit, Mewtwo V-Star right there, so there's my second one. I believe, so nice. Centering is a little bit off, so that one will go into the separate binder. Now I need to pull one more, which hopefully is perfect, which would go towards Raiden. There you go. Lightning energy, hammer rot. Egg Incubator, Water to Apom, Spinneret, Patito. I'd also like to pull one of each of all of the, um, what are they called? EVs? Yahoo! And a Mount Metal VMAX. <laughs> nice, already got this one. But again, it's a hit. So, two hits so far from Radiant EV. But, I think the Mount Metal Full Up and the Radiant Blastoise will take the win either way. If it comes down to it. Oh, I forgot the cold cards by his right, so that's one. Let me just put down the screen for you. And two. I think that should be it. And then one more. Yeah, come down to it depending on what else I pull on this. On this really easy. Elite trainer box is probably going to take the win. Water energy. Candela, Flintown, Ivysaur, Oversaur, Spurtle, Hidoof, Onyx, Meltan, Reverse Colossal Pod, and the Hollow Venusaur. Now that I pulled that one Venusaur, I pulled it like every other pack. I mean, it wouldn't, it shouldn't, have, shouldn't be that like hard anyway, because you get a Hollow in every pack, so, you know. At some point you pull it. The one card that I haven't pulled. That much is the um, Articuno. Articuno I've only pulled once. Number two, reverse Ariados. Nice, I need that one. Oh, this one's gonna be a tough one. Now we got a Kong Kelder V Full Art. Nice. Two Full Art in this opening. Yes, one from each product. I will take that happy. I will happily take that. Yes, yes, yes. I think the print quality on all of these cards from Pokemon Go is terrible. This one would be fine, but it's tilted. Alright, so there you go. There's a gold card, and there's three packs left with three codes, so there you go. Oh, so far it could be neck and neck. Although it's a V-Star and a V-Max, so if you're talking in terms of Ultra Rares, the Radiant Eevee might be taking the win. I think even, I think, ah, does the Radiant, yeah, speaking of Articuno, there you go. Does the Radiant Blastoise help the Elite Trainer Box take the win on this one?
secret rares seem to be tough pulls this. Slowbow, Lunatone, Chauncey, Golden Latita, Tooth, Charmander, Apom, Bulbasaur, Reverse Wimpod. Let's go! Dragon Wow. There's only two B stars, right? And I pulled both of them in one EV box. Nice, so I've doubled up on me to V Star and Dragonite V Star, which I'm happy about because I need to. Nice, nice, nice. Right, so I'd say Eevee has taken the win now. Reading Eevee definitely has taken the win on this one. Will we get some last pack magic as well? Nah, I doubt it. There's no way that it, it can't be this good. Eight packs, four hits. Yeah, nah. So one and two. In this one but if you haven't seen that last video as well that yes oh my days last pack magic guys last pack magic badly centered badly centered radiant charizard but i have pulled it oh yes oh my um nothing on the back yeah nothing on the back Oh, the Radiant Charizard, yes! I was not expecting that, I was expecting just to be disappointed. As I was saying, with the last EV box, wow, that was disappointing. That was absolutely disappointing. Oh, Radiant Charizard, yes! Alright guys, recap time. It was a close one. It was a real close one. I wasn't expecting this opening. This was a really good opening. I am really, really happy about this one. Alright, so, of course, promo card muted. It, it looks beautiful. So, gotta add that into it. So, that factors it. Muted V as well. Another nice artwork on a V. Melmetal V. Radiant Blastoise. And a full art Melmetal V. That was the Elite Trainer box. This one is Radiant Eevee, so we got a Mel Metal V Max. Mewtwo V Star. Dragonite V Star. Conquer the Full Art. And a Radiant Charizard. To me, Radiant Eevee 100% took the win on this one. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments down below which you think won. It could be based on favorite cards, it could be based on the rarity. But to me, reading EV1. If you enjoyed this video, if you stuck with me to the end, I'd appreciate it if you could leave a like, subscribe, turn notifications on for more, and I will see you on the next one, guys. Peace.